best team in the AFC right now is? Um, I'm still going to say the Chiefs, even though I don't think anyone wants to play the Chargers in a tough playoff game. The one thing I worry about the Chiefs is they really are a dome team. That's what it feels like, their offense. What happens if they get home playoff games in Kansas City and you have a snowy, wet, windy mm-hmm. game? Um, because they're not a great defensive team. And so I don't think they're going to hold up over 60 minutes defensively. Will they be able to score points in bad weather? Also with Mahomes, he's doing things that you just he, – he makes them seem a little more normal or routine, but they're not. And you have played with great quarterbacks, being an offensive lineman. Uh, how do you assess what you see with Mahomes when he's under duress? Uh, it's His arm strength is what allows him to do things that are uncanny. And what it does to a defense, it, makes, it forces you to cover more of the field. Because where a guy scrambling, you know, you might have 50 yards of depth to cover as a defense. You better extend that 15 yards with Patrick Mahomes because there's no, you know, there's no telling where he's going to throw it. And not only that, he could be rolling to his right. We saw it last night. And, you know, the cardinal rules don't throw back over the middle of the field. Well, he does it consistently, and he has such a, a, a arm strength. He can throw across his body on a line, and the ball can get there, uh, which I don't know how many – I've never seen a guy – try it like he does and i'm not sure how many guys in the history of this league have had the arm strength that patrick Mahomes has for more dan patrick show tune to audience channel 239 on direct tv or download the dan patrick show app